Game over. What is going on, YouTube? Fox, you're welcome to USA with a brand new video. And in today's video, we are going to be playing Modern Warfare 2 in 2020. So I hope you guys do enjoy. If you guys do, make sure you guys leave your like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications. But before I get this video started, I do want to give a huge shout out to the sponsor of this video, Moot. Moot is a free mobile app that is guaranteed to improve your gaming experience. Whether you're looking for new teammates or people to play with, or you're looking to get better at the game that you're playing, or you just want to laugh at some hilarious memes, Moot is for you. Moot has a bunch of gaming groups that you can join in order to find new players to play with. They have groups for games like Call of Duty, Rainbow Six, Halo, Apex Legends, Grand Theft Auto and Fortnite. I know everybody loves all those games. And not only that, but Moot is available on iOS, Android, and your computer. So it's 100% free to use and enjoy. And I heard that there's a bunch of giveaways to get consoles, controllers, keyboards, and more of that good stuff that all us gamers love. So go down in the description below and download Moot now. Connect with the rest of the gaming community. All right, well, I'm actually really surprised. I, uh, I found a game on Modern Warfare 2 faster than any other Call of Duty that I've been trying to play for, like, the past, like, I don't know, hour or two. I've been trying to play games that you guys have been requesting, and I haven't been able to get into any game. So I'm really, really sorry if some of these videos are taking a little bit longer than normal. You know, normally, I have no problem playing these games and stuff like that, but I just can't find games. There's nobody playing these games, and the servers are just kind of messing with me. Wow, Painkiller sucks. I hate Painkiller. We're on Modern Warfare 2, my favorite Call of Duty. Yeah, this game is my favorite. I love Modern Warfare 2 to death. I think Modern Warfare 2 is the best Call of Duty that's ever been released ever in the days of ever. Goodbye. Goodbye. And I got shot from up top. The phone is ringing. The phone. The phone is ringing. Hello there. Oh my god, that guy scared the hell out of me. I think Modern Warfare 2 is the best Call of Duty ever because it's got overpowered weapons, it's fun, and it just has amazing maps. I think the maps in Modern Warfare 2 are the best in Call of Duty history, personally. But, I mean, that's pretty biased, so... Triple kill. Triple kill. <laughs> it's biased, I know. And it's it's so crazy, too, because Modern Warfare 2 is always the Call of Duty that takes me the longest to find games, and now it's all the Treyarch games. But I do have a question for you guys. If you, let me know down in the comments. If you guys want me to play Black Ops 2 on PC, I'll do that as well, because obviously everyone's playing Black Ops 2 on PC right now, so if you guys want me to do that, I'll do that for the next video or the video after that. And I have also gotten all of your comments about Rainbow Six Siege. I will be doing a Rainbow Six Siege video. It'll probably come out within the next couple weeks. We got the TAW 20 one and uh, this is one of the best guns in this game guys let me know down in the comments what's your favorite weapon in modern warfare 2 mine is the acr i i know that's like super typical and it's stereotypical and it's pretty much almost everyone's answer to the question but but still the acr and mw2 is awesome and as you saw last game we were kind of doing well with it oh god the lag Guys, just sitting in the corner. This year's Modern Warfare has been contagious for every single game. Good God, the lag. I'm actually super glad I found a game because, like, I can't find a game in any other games. I didn't think I was going to find a match, honestly, because it's so hard to find other matches in the other games. But, you know, it is what it is, I guess. There's another guy around there. Dude, I suck! You blew it. I think it's awesome that people still play this game, man. I think it's I think it's really awesome. It keeps the game alive, man. And that nostalgia for me, it's just nice. I just have this feeling they're gonna spawn behind us, and I really don't want that to happen, so <gasps> chuck that right there. Okay. I don't even know where that went. Oh we got him. Okay, cool. <laughs> back there with a new tube the camping is contagious from the newest call of duty and now everyone's doing it in all the older games it's crazy i never really ran into camping in the old call of duty games obviously like you had it in there and stuff like that because like it's call of duty people are gonna camp and stuff like that and that was just terrible aim that was just awful i'm, I'm so bad someone also gave me an idea i want you guys to pick one game in particular each month that's not call of duty and i will play it for a video each month for example january will be rainbow six siege because we got a bunch of siege comments and and then in February, I want you guys to comment what game you guys want me to play most. I'll pick the most popular vote, and I'll do that for one video. It'll be like the game of the month or something like that. I don't know. I would prefer if it was a shooter, because that way it 
kind of stays within the content that I already produced in Call of Duty. So like if it was Halo, Siege, I don't know, maybe Battlefield or something like that, you know, Apex Legends, uh, even Fortnite or, you know, whatever, you know, I I'm down. And then let me also know what other classic Call of Duties you guys want me to do. I promise you guys, I'm trying to work on Black Ops 1 and I'm trying to work on World of War, but I just can't find games. Use code FOXY for 30% off all G Fuel products and the brand new G Fuel Condit Shaker. It's fabulous! And, and it helps me out as a content creator. Okay, bye! So guys, let me know what your favorite map is in Modern Warfare 2. Mine is Terminal. I think Terminal is the greatest map in Call of Duty history, personally. Maybe I'm biased a little bit, a teeny weensy bit. Some people like to say that BO2 maps are up there with it, and I'm just like, nah. Nah, bro, you can't, you can't, bro. But Afghan is a really good map as well. I, it's so crazy that this game has been out for a, has been out for like 11 years. It's been 11 years since this game actually came out. You'll be using Last Stand. Why? All right, you know, I feel like this wouldn't be a Modern Warfare 2 video without using the UMP. You know, the UMP is possibly one of the greatest guns in Call of Duty history, and it's probably one of the best guns in this game, if not the best gun in this game. I don't have Dead Silence on. And they heard me, because they're all just sitting back with LMGs. What is this, World War II? Uh-oh, retard alert. Retard alert, class. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That silence UMP? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, yeah, ooh. Stop sitting in a corner, hit you with a slow bag. Guys, what do you think the best gun in Modern Warfare 2 is? I think it's this gun. I think that just like all around, it's just a two-tap machine, and I think it's really freaking good. Look at that, easy. Two shots to the chest there, buddy. Oh, there's no one in there. Um, I'm gonna toss this all the way over there, see if that hits anyone. Oh yeah! That's pretty goddamn impressive. There's a guy over there, dude. He's like camping over there again. Surprise, motherfucker. You know, I don't remember Modern Warfare 2 playing like this, honestly. I, I really don't. Modern Warfare 2, like, yeah, of course you would get like, well, you would get like one or two people that are camping, right? You'd get like one or two because they're going for a new, but not the entire fucking team sitting in corners and shit. Oh my God. No. There's two. No! So the new Modern Warfare released a crossbow. And in order to unlock the crossbow, you can either buy it in the shop or you can do like a challenge and whatnot. And the challenge is like five kills and 25 matches and whatnot. And we had people complaining about it. And I was just like, bro, you guys never played Modern Warfare 2 apparently. Because during Modern Warfare 2, if you had to do a camo, you would have to get your 250 headshots. And then on top of it, you would have to prestige if you wanted to. If you wanted to prestige, you had to like unlock all the camos again. It's like ridiculous. Like it just shows that some of these people didn't play Modern Warfare 2. And it's sad. It, it saddens me. It makes me upset, honestly. If there were two things in Modern Warfare 2 that I would take from other COD games, it would be supply drops and COD points, of course. I mean, duh. Why? Because fuck them, that's why. It's like, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. If there were two things that I could take from other Call of Duty games and put in this game, it would be either Stalker or Stock, either one. I really don't care. I feel like that would make this Call of Duty, like, the best. Like, it would it would be, oh yeah! It would be, like, notorious for making this Call of Duty the greatest one ever. But uh, I guess another thing that I would like, like a final camo. That I, Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll go with that. A final camo. That isn't fall, obviously. Modern Warfare 2 just has this, like, yeah, eat that, please. Double kill. That's a double. Triple kill. Three. I tried to blow up those, uh, what's it called, it's on the side, or the barrels back there, but th that didn't really work any of my advantage. I'm trying to flank these guys from the back here. Double kill. No, dude! Oh! And in this game, you can get two sets of Harriers in the air at the same time. How fucking awesome is that? <laughs> dude, stop running final stand, bro. Holy shit, they all just like spawned right here. They're all running painkiller too! Did you guys see that? Those guys just spawned like right on top of one another. Okay, so they're spawning back there. Pretty sure? Or no? Dude, the painkiller! 
Holy shit! I don't miss Painkiller and I don't miss Juggernaut. Speaking of Jug, do you guys want me to go back and play Call of Duty 4? I mean, because I will. I mean, that's actually a game I forgot about. I'm not even gonna lie, because I played Remastered already. So, like, I, I feel like... It'd be weird to go back and play the original, but like we can still go back and play it. Like I don't, I don't have a problem with it, of course. Hold on, I'm gonna try and run this way. I'm gonna try and get something. I don't know if I will be able to or not, but of course there's a guy sitting right there in the corner waiting for me. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's just hiding. He's hiding. Well, he's not. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. The fucking mod on his goddamn controller. This guy's name is OG Nuke Out, and he's using a fucking mod on his FAL. That's that's so awesome. You're so good, dude. Holy shit! The lag! Run over here. There's one. Now they're they're all just like sitting in here. Hold on. Fuck! And of course, I got fucking noob tube. That's lovely. Some smooth connection right here, though. I'll tell you that. Not so smooth noob tubes right there. Of course, this guy's sitting right there. Yeah, of course. Now, if you know how to play for a nuke on this map, you know that you should never use the chopper gunner because the chopper gunner is just really, really slow. It's not a slow streak, obviously, but it's just slow getting into this map in particular. So most people use the AC-130. However, I forgot to put on the AC-130 because I didn't know what map we were playing on. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna throw that right there. You're gonna die. Thank you. Yep. Oh my god! Oh my. I want to just compose. What the fuck, man? Painkiller and then the noob tube? And that's why I died. That's literally why I died. I don't know why I had this just sudden urge to snipe on this map, but I think a sniping. I think a sniping on the Barrett is pretty fun, so. I've never dropped a nuke with a sniper before. That would be pretty insane. Okay, I didn't see him, but then, oh, there's a guy. Of course it killed me out of everybody! I wish they would make a map that's like very similar to Wasteland. But honestly, you know what? I'm gonna be real. I feel like if they did, then everyone would just kind of like camp around the outside. And I feel like that's like just like no fun. I, I love that it's wide open, but I just feel like people today would just make the map campy. Like obviously like people would do it like back in the day, but it wasn't anything like people do today. But guys, I think that's gonna do it for today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy Modern Warfare 2 in 2020. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave a like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications. Which classic Call of Duty would you guys like me to do next? Let me know down in the comments. Also, let me know what the game of the month you guys want me to do. I, it's most likely going to be Rainbow Six Siege for January. You know, obviously, Doom comes out in, like, March or something like that. I'll keep playing Call of Duty, obviously. Uh, we can play Halo. I, I've gotten a bunch of, like, Halo requests, so we're definitely going to do, like, Halo 3 or something like that. Big shout-out to Moot for sponsoring this video as well. And, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.